the other 29 teams pass over. But he comes to the Warriors and automatically looks like an all-star. And wouldn't you know it, the team has found another diamond in the rough with Lester Quinones. And this kid might be one of the best Warrior finds ever. How's it going today, guys? My name is Troy, and this is the Half Court Report YouTube channel. Real quick, before we get into it today, be sure you like this video and subscribe if you're new for some of the best basketball content you're going to find on YouTube. I'm desperate for any kind of NBA basketball, so of course, I have been devouring every summer league game that I can find. And the guy who has stood out to me more than anyone is Lester Quinones. The Warriors actually signed him to a two-way contract late last season after a stellar year with their G League team in Santa Cruz. In 49 games, the 6'5 shooting guard averaged 20 points, 6 rebounds, 4 assists, and a steal. Quinones also shot nearly 38% from 3 on 8 attempts. After being called up to the Warriors' main roster for the final four games of the regular season, he averaged 20 points, 6 rebounds, 4 assists, two steals, and 50% shooting from three per 36 minutes. Crazy numbers, and that is continuing into a dominant summer league performance. Quinones has been playing out of his mind and is making a strong case for one of Golden State's two remaining roster spots. I thought that his summer league matchup with Brandon Miller was especially telling as to the potential Quinones has. You remember Miller, he was just drafted at number two by the Hornets and is going to be having nightmares about Quinones. Lester served as the primary defender on Miller during their summer league game and held him to six points on just four field goal attempts. Quinones plays much bigger than his 6'5 frame. He has a 6'10 wingspan, thick shoulders, strong legs, and good basketball fundamentals. He's also not afraid to get physical and mix it up. And engaged as he's been defensively, it's Quinones' play on the other side of the ball that has really opened our eyes once again. And that might soon lead to a standard NBA contract. The scouting report on Lester Quinones is just what you want out of a modern NBA wing. He's a shooter with a quick release that can get into his shot motion at an elite speed, and he has the ability to defend. He has also developed his handle, allowing him to be a creator at times to score off the dribble. Lester moves well without the ball, and he's continuing to improve in his game, as witnessed in the G League and this summer. Got me thinking, who else was an overlooked prospect that is a dead-eye shooter from deep and a menace defensively? Could the Warriors actually have another Klay Thompson on their hands? I mean, with the right development and Lester Quinones' positive attitude, I think it could happen. The Warriors won't find a better blend of shot making and comfort in Steve Kerr's system on the minimum market than what they'll have in Quinones. No gettable free agent guard projects as a rotation player for Golden State, and they most certainly can't match Quinones' long-term upside as a multi-level scorer, secondary playmaker, and workable defender off the bench. The energy that Quinones provides offensively could be a fantastic addition for the aging Warriors across that 82-game grind, and next season could serve as a launching pad toward an expanded role in the future. So as we look ahead, the Warriors are bringing the same offensively elite core they had this season, and if they want to remain contenders, they need to improve their roster by finding players that supplement their needs and weaknesses. I think Lester Quinones can be that player at a bargain price. Guys, I want you to tell me what you think in the comments. Am I just drinking the Lester Quinones Kool-Aid, or would he actually be a legit good signing for the Warriors? What type of contract would you give him? If you've enjoyed today's video, show some love by leaving a like and subscribe if you're new. Be sure to check out some of the other videos I have posted on this channel. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Troy. This has been the Half Court Report, and I'll catch you next time. Have a great day.